Hi Stamper, today I'm going to show you how to make this cute little bunny here. I did it quite a few times. You see I get quite a few collection over here. I'm having a tough time if somebody can give me a pointer out to download when it's more than 15 minutes. It take me about four hours. I don't have that patient. And then the next one was way off. So you couldn't even see what I was doing. So it's for the Urshi Kisses and you just slide it in there. You can do it with um, put a glue dot on it so it stay. What you're going to need, it's a piece of cardstock five and a half by one and a half. You're going to score it two and a half at each end. So uh, not two and a half, two and a quarter, two and a quarter. So you're going to get this little tent here. We're going to start with the feet. The feet, it's the large oval punch and you need two of them and I sponge around it with early espresso. So for the feet, I'm going to put just a little bit of snail here. And you want to put it a little bit longer. Let's say the feet's going to be like down here. Don't worry about it go off there. We're going to cut that off. And just put it so there his feet go out. So now his feet are there. Turn it around and we're going to cut that off. Where it's too long, we're just going to snip this off. So then when you sit in, you're going to stay perfectly fine. So that it's there. I took the small punch, the half inch punch, and I did it in pretty and pink, and I already pre-done uh, the sponging around it. So now I just have to glue them. And then we're going to, the little tiny one, it's the same, the eyes and the feet, and that's with this old punch here. So what I'm going to do for that, I'm going to use the tumble glue. That's worked the best. It's very strong. I love it for little details like this. And then I'm going to take those little uh, pink uh, dots. Maybe, maybe not. Here we go. Let's do the other three here. I got one in my mouth. That's what you want to do a few. Here we go. So now we... Oops, do I need more glue down? Okay, now his feet are done. We're going to do his ears. The ears, we're just going to put a little bit of glue over there. Again, I pre-punched uh, them with the small oval. Put his ears there. Maybe I can put it a little bit higher. Okay, and then this, the three hard punch, I use the small one, and that's the same for his nose. We're going to put, um, where's my glue dot that's going to go quick here. So I'm going to put his little ears, two little arts in his ears. And now for his face, we're going to start with the eyes. So with the eyes, I need the black head. Oh, I get two there. Perfect. We're going to use the tumble glue, and I'm going to do two little dots. Here we go. Twist it down a bit. And then here's the other one. Okay, now for his um, little fat cheek. This is the half inch um, circle. Let's hope somebody's going to take that. And you just overlap like this. Then for his whisker, you just take a little strip of white and then cut it little sliver. And we're going to put some snail in the back. 
put this there. And then where's my scissors? So when I mean just little tiny slivers. And then when I curl them, oops, let me get this here. When I curl them, I just pull on them like this. I'm going to put that right there. Don't worry if they're equal or not. We can give him a little haircut after. Put the dimensional. Pop this out. Let's put him in the center. So I'm going to pull one of his whisker right now. And you know what? Let's put this one a little bit more. Here we go. You got some wild whisker, this one. You can see just in between there. Then take a little heart again. And this one going to go upside down. Just like this. Take the whisker, this one, it's a little bit too high. Here we go. And then we're going to take that gel pen, give him some little eyes in there. And then take your black marker and on the fine tip, do three little dots. And then to tie him up, we're going to use a little piece of taffeta ribbon in the chocolate chip and we're going to put him together. I could have put his face a little bit lower. I should have put it lower, but hopefully I won't have to start this again. Going to do two little holes here and we're going to pass the ribbon. Front to the back and then come back in the front. And we're just going to tie a little tiny knot, just once. Trim this up. I should say trim this down. Et voila, that is it. And then I would take my nuggets and put them in here. So. That's our little guys for today. Hope you learned something new. Till next time, happy stamping.